Papua New Guinea has embarked on moving the aviation industry and air navigation forward into the modern era. Funding for this upgrade to aviation technology is being provided by the Australian government at a cost of about 8.1 million kina. We may look back into the future and say that this is perhaps the single most significant aviation event in not only moving air navigation systems in Papua New Guinea into the modern era, but in opening up large regional and rural communities to aviation access previously not available to them because of weather conditions. The Global Navigation Satellite System, or GNSS, project will enable satellite-based navigation at up to 45 airports and airstrips throughout the country, greatly improving safety and efficiency. Safety standards and safety compliance cannot be traded off against other aspects of government spending in the air transport subsector. Through this policy statement, the government requires the aviation entities, CASA, NAC and PNG ASL to make passenger safety its first priority. Australian High Commission Minister Councillor Benedict David noted the broader benefits of the project for PNG's economy. This will make a real difference in the lives of the many communities that rely on safe arrival of planes to deliver essential goods and services and connect them to the rest of the country. This project will allow for greater efficiency in aviation operations, which we anticipate will lead to reduced operating costs and increased competition across the sector, benefiting both the travelling public and local business. PNG Air Services Managing Director and CEO Captain Ted Pucky said the transition from ground-based navigational aids to this satellite-based technology will greatly improve the reliability and accuracy that is lacking with ground-based infrastructure in the country. The satellite-based technology will remove the ongoing issues related to, uh, related to ground-based navigational facilities. Issues such as land ownership uh, disputes, uh, vandalism, theft, unreliable um, uh, third party service providers, uh, communication links, and power supplies, and so on and so forth. Given PNG's rugged terrain, the aviation sector plays a critical role in keeping businesses and communities connected. GNSS-based approaches will also help to reduce aircraft emissions and fuel costs by enabling improved and more efficient flight paths. Deli Waigeno, National, MTV News.